Welcome everyone. Welcome to your channel, Efficient Profits. I'm back again with uh, one more, uh, one more Python code, uh, which I believe will make your life more easier and less monotonous. So, uh, in the last video which we saw, we saw that when you have a website link, how you can download all the PDF files which is there in the website. So today the concept is quite similar, but what if we do not want to download the PDF files, but if we want to download the tables, which the website has so just like uh, we'll take the example of the GST site only if it has those uh, tables, the notification heading, the notification description. So that table is there into the GST site. How can we download that table in an Excel file? Similarly, we can have many other uh, websites which has tables. How can we download the table directly into an Excel? So that we will be looking. So let's start. So uh, just like uh, the extracting the PDF, even this is a form of a web web scrapping. And um, yes, we are downloading. So this is the GST site. It has that table which has this notification number, English, Hindi, and subject. So what if I want this table into an Excel file? So one option will be that directly you copy paste from the website but that is not something which is automatic or which is code driven. So that is why um, like there is one more website, which is this responsive table. So you can, one option is to copy paste, but that is not a very clean way of doing. So that is why what we have is whenever you have any website, which has some sort of tables, how do you download that table directly to an Excel file? Okay, so with this, I have uh, this small weight and this code is very easy. If you even if you have very, very basic knowledge of uh, pandas and Python, you will be able to see how the code works and how simply the code is written. Okay, it's a very simple code. Um, and uh, I would say the effectively the code is very uh, only three or four liner code. Okay, I'll try to download this uh, CGST website and this website uh, using responsive tables. These two websites, I'll try to download the tables into an Excel file. So this is the code. Uh, this might seem like a 10, 15 lines, but if you really dig, uh, read the code, you will find that the main work happens only in two or three lines. So I'll just simply write this uh, function, extract URL table, and then I'll give it the extension. Uh, sorry, not the extension, the URL path. I've given this notification or HTML URL path, and I've done this extract URL table input URL I've given folder path will be same in which the code is being written. So there is some error. Okay. I have not run the code. Mm, let's try to rerun it again. Folder location. Okay. Okay. I, I just made at least I made some last minute changes and that is why this error is coming. Uh, okay. I'll, I'll, I will upload the revised code in, uh, in the cloud. So don't worry, you'll, you'll get the code, which won't have any errors. So let me run this again. I have I've corrected the error. Okay. Now you can see the table has been extracted. Okay. The table is extracted it is stored into this file name. So let's see the table. Okay. This is the Excel table output uh, output. So if you see the output, this is something like this notifications, Hindi, English and subject. Okay. So in this way, the output has come and it seems quite decent because you can see it's very clean. It's rather than copy pasting the entire thing. It has simply brought the table to an Excel file. There are around 377 rows I can see. Okay. So this is how you extract table and it's very simple. Like it happened within like one or two seconds. Similarly, if you have some other uh, URL like this one, you can uh, have the same code. Uh, the code will be same. Thus the extract URL table thing you will have to put in, in, uh, in the front, we'll put extract table, URL table, and then cover it with the parentheses, the small brackets. Okay. You just execute it. And within seconds, it will, it will give you the Excel file. It given you the Excel file. Okay. So in that way, it's very uh, simple to use. You can see this Excel file and uh, yeah. So pretty much yeah, the website and thing or whatever thing was there into the, in the website, that thing has come. So yeah, I'm just doing some sort of formatting so that it appears into a single screen. And uh, yes, traffic. So uh, just the thing is that uh, 
whenever you have such set such set of data where you have to like uh, download uh, we have to like uh, you have the table and you want it in excel file and sometimes what happens is that you have multiple such urls to loop so at that point of time having such code is very beneficial because it will just loop and it will convert the table and you can you can modify that uh, code as per your own requirement and you can append the table one by one also so once you have the code you have that power to customize anything you like as per your choice so that is why this is a simple code to extract a table from a particular url okay so i hope uh, this code will be useful for you and uh, this code will work only for those web pages which has table like in that ici site if there is no table it won't work okay so this was a very small demonstration of how you can extract your tables from a particular url if you have been given a site links and there is a table then all that table will be uh, downloaded into an excel file so i hope you liked it and you will be using it in your offices in your daily work if you have any questions or doubts do let me know in the comment section or in the email id which is given in the description box thank you for watching and stay tuned for more such videos